This is ETV Bharat. Welcome to News Time. On Wednesday, newly appointed Haryana Chief Minister Nayab Singh Saini moved a confidence motion for his government in the state assembly. Five JJP MLAs left the house after CM Saini moved the confidence vote in the special session. On Tuesday, External Affairs Minister S J Shankar held a productive meeting with New Zealand's Deputy Prime Minister and Foreign Affairs Minister Winston Peters, discussing cooperation in Commonwealth and the United Nations Security Council reforms. Amit CAA Row Union Home Minister Amit Shah visited the Bhagya Lakshmi Temple in Charminar, Hyderabad, and offered prayers on Tuesday in a gesture that speaks of symbolism and substance as BJP gears to kick up Lok Sabha poll campaign in the southern state. Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Wednesday participated in India's Tech Aid Chips for Vikasit Bharat and laid the foundation stone of three semiconductor projects worth about rupees 1.25 lakh crore via video conferencing. The Apex Court agreed to hear on March 15 the plea seeking to restrain fresh appointments to the ECI following the legislation which excludes the CGI from the process of appointment of the CEC and the ECs. Associates of late opposition leader Alexei Navalny said that the politician's close ally and top strategist was attacked near his home in Lithuania's capital. A rocket touted as Japan's first from the private sector to go into orbit exploded shortly after takeoff on Wednesday. Live streamed video showed. US President Biden and his predecessor Donald Trump have clinched their party's presidential nomination, setting the stage for a 2020 rematch during the November elections. Elsie Perry came up with an all-round show as she snapped a record six-wicket haul and then smashed an unbeaten 40 to set up Royal Challengers Bangalore's dominating seven-wicket win over Mumbai Indians. Actor Pulkit Samrat and Kriti Kharbanda are all set to tie the knot on March 15, 2024. The couple will be opting for a Punjabi wedding starting with Mehendi on Wednesday. Log on to etvbharat.com for latest news.